What makes you itch? What sort of a situation would you like? Let's suppose I do this often in vocational guidance of students. They come to me and say, well, uh, we're getting out of college and we have the faintest idea what we want to do. So I always ask the question, what would you like to do if money were no object? How would you really enjoy spending your life? Well, it's so amazing. As a result of our kind of educational system, crowds of students say, well, we'd like to be painters, we'd like to be poets, we'd like to be writers, but as everybody knows, you can't earn any money that way. When we finally got down to something which the individual says he really wants to do, I will say to him, you do that. So somebody's interested in everything. And anything you can be interested in, you'll find others who are. But it's absolutely stupid to spend your time doing things you don't like and to teach your children to follow in the same track. See, what we're doing is we're bringing up children and educating them to live the same sort of lives we're living in order that the, they may justify themselves and find satisfaction in life by bringing up their children, to bring up their children to do the same thing so it's all wretch and no vomit. It never gets there. Therefore, it's so important to consider this question. What do I desire? So I am all packed and ready to go and about to make my road trip to California.